right, we're in luck, but what about the drive out of town? We check the Cone Pass, South Orange County, and the drive to and at the airports. Tomorrow. From Fox 5 in the Port of San Diego, this is the Big Baby Boom with Raul Martinez and Kathleen Bain. White and blue, in circles, stars, and more. Four barges, one show, and beautiful San Diego Bay. America's finest city, hosting the biggest 4th of July fireworks on the West Coast. San Diego's 19th annual Big Bay Boom Fireworks Celebration. We're so glad you're here on Fox 5 and KTLA. I'm Kathleen Bay. And I'm Raul Martinez. Happy 4th of July. We are live at the beautiful Hilton San Diego Bayfront Hotel alongside the beautiful Embarcadero here in San Diego. And in just about 30 minutes from now, the party's really going to get going because we have the biggest, as you just heard the announcer say, it's the biggest 4th of July fireworks show on the west coast lighting up the night sky and we have several cameras around the bay on the ground and in the sky to give you the best view from your own living room of the fireworks you'll see them from the embarcadero the uss midway coronado and point loma okay and get ready get ready because this year brand new we're trying to pull off a brand new shot Fox 5 is the only FAA-approved nighttime drone allowed to fly during the fireworks show. So we're going to keep checking back in to see if the signal holds up. Fireworks, as you know, could be sometimes be a lot to handle with all the new technology, but we hope that everything goes well. It's going to be spectacular. All what right. An angle. We're excited. And yeah. something else that's new this year, you may not have known, but the fireworks show is also designed to help mark and celebrate the 250th anniversary of San Diego itself. America's finest city is considered the birthplace of California. Also, we have a surprise for a local military family that is so special. It's something we've never done on the show before. We w cannot wait to share it with you. It's going to be special. It's going to be special. Maybe tears will be shed. Maybe. <laughs> uh, half a million people expected to watch tonight's big fireworks display along the San Diego waterfront. Mm. Half a million people. They're all behind us partying it up. We can hear them. Mm. Not to mention up to 20 million people watching on television from Mexico all the way up to Santa Barbara and to Palm Springs. Our coverage being simulcast by our good friends and our sister station up at KTLA. And speaking of Southern California, we had one of the strongest earthquakes hit this morning that has struck in California in our region in 20 years. So we just want to take a quick moment to thank all the first responders for dealing with the aftermath and to just recognize any people who might be suffering tonight. And we really hope that tonight's fireworks will give everyone some sense of normalcy on this yeah. 4th of July. Yeah, that was quite a for everyone today, for sure. Okay, now we want to give you a, a bit of an idea for you uh, where we are for this 4th of July. There are four barges all along the San Diego Bay. We, right now where we are, we're near the South Embarcadero Barge. The North Embarcadero Barge is near the USS Midway Museum. That's in front of our very own Heather Lake. And then there's the Harbor Island Barge. And finally, the Shelter Island Barge. All four, by the way, they're synced up to a, deliver an absolutely spectacular fireworks show. And it never fails to impress. It's really moving. In fact, you mentioned the ground crew, yeah. so let's check in with them and get a look at their vantage point. We have Dole Colk, who is live for us in Coronado, but we want to check in with our Heather Lake. She is on the flight deck of the USS Midway Museum. Heather. Oh, good evening and happy 4th of July. This is where the party is. The USS Midway Museum has an annual 4th of July party and it is getting started. This is one of the premier spots to watch the fireworks and she's been called the floating city on the sea. Whenever she was commissioned, that's what they called her because she had 4,500 people who worked on this ship. To give you a little perspective, tonight there's about 4,000 people just on the flight deck for the party. So it is a packed house. 